What's going on guys? I know I have not made a video in a long time. I've been a little bit busy but some family things and I am going out hunting so I'm not pretty uh, on top of the game here. I'm gonna try and film one of my hunts but we'll see how that goes. But we are out here at a private pond. I'm gonna try and get some fish and whatnot. Some some other things maybe maybe some grass because I'll catch a lot of grass because that's what I do and uh, he's already hooked up with a fish which is of course but I'm going to be rolling with probably a Texas rig worm and maybe maybe throw a spook who knows we'll see how that goes but I am rolling with this new awesome Bushido braid from American Tackle Company and uh, I know I know you guys probably haven't heard of American Tackle because they really haven't made a real name for themselves through products, but they make guides for uh, rods and they're starting to make uh, lures, uh, braids, stuff like that. And it's really awesome. If you like the, the shirt I'm wearing, I know you can't see it because my camera's in the way or, or the hat, they've got awesome products. Go check them out. I'll put a link down in the description, but let's get at these fish and try and catch some guys. Alright, I actually changed my mind. I'm probably gonna throw this crawl kind of on a Texas Texas thing. Look at him, look at him. He's just cranking in fish left and right. But I, I, I absolutely love this braid. Uh, I've never used braid in my life, but it's amazing because it's so thin, cuts through the grass, and it's, it's strong. It, it's got no stretch whatsoever. So it's, it's just absolutely amazing for pretty much everything. There we go. There's a fish. First one on the crawl. Probably absolutely mangled my crawl. But, I mean, it is what it is. Ooh, fish. About time. Didn't take too long, but I found him. Get out of here. Whew. Didn't even really have to set the hook on that one. That was good. On the top water Texas rig. That's funny. That's great. That is absolutely perfect. That's awesome. <laughs> wow. Granted, he's not big at all, but it's still a fish that I caught on a Texas rig on the top of the water. fish. This isn't a bad one either. There we go. 
here's another fish. Um, I'm actually going to throw him on a stringer so I can get pictures later. But it's not a bad looking fish. I noticed something. It's got a really screwed up lip there. Got the mutated fish now. This one's fat though. I don't think it's as big, but I think it's fatter. I think I'll put him on too. Maybe. Eh. Eh. Huh? Oh yeah. I think I'm gonna let this guy go. Just uh, give him a nice little toss out there. Definitely, I think I'm gonna need a new crawl because uh, I think it's destroyed. There we go. I, mean, I need to change this drag. That's a good one. Yeah, that one's definitely going on. Yep, definitely going on. There we go. That's the one I was looking for. Whew. All right, I decided to do some pond hopping last minute. We left that last place started catching a lot of fish and they seemed like it was the same fish over and over but we are at the academy pond runway pond whatever you want to call it maybe we'll actually get to fish here because all the grass matting is on the other side instead of right here so let's try and catch some fish guys fish off the gigantic spook as soon as it hit the water Woo. it's not a bad looking fish either he only got two of the hooks which is good because you never want all of these hooks that's awesome Here we go, first fish. Very, very good looking fish. All right, let's get, let's get this guy out of here as I almost die and fall in the water. All right, so I'm finally home. I didn't get to do an outro while I was there because my car kind of died for uh, some odd reason. So I had to wait until my buddy came and got me a jump. So we're finally home and hopefully you guys liked that video. Got, got some fishing done today. If you guys like it, make sure you guys subscribe and come back for more.